Sausage cheese balls. Let's get it, dude. Now these sausage balls right here, easy, easy, easy. You and your kids could do it. It's a great little appetizer, a little, a little something you could serve before a football game. We got two pounds of that ground breakfast sausage right there. Start with that. Two cream cheese. Let's get that in there. Make sure they soft. We making a mess like all the time. Now mix that in there real good. Get them in there. Get that in there. You could add it all if you want to mix it, but it's easy to mix them right from the beginning. Here we go. Now it's time to quit buffooning around. Back to the recipes. Back to good cooking. Hit that with that little gator drool. Get it in there good like that. That's some good stuff. Gouda, sharp cheddar, copious amount. Two cups of that beer is quick, whatever that means. I think that's some kind of bacon stuff. Now let's get in there and get nasty. Mix this around. I'm gonna make a terrible mess, but you gotta get in there. I wish I had a bigger bowl. Get in there, mix it good. Boom, all right. Now as you're mixing that around, I'm gonna hit it with the two-step, mix it in there good. More two-step, mix it in there. I'm getting it everywhere. Get it in there good. Look at that, see how it's coming? It's gonna make some beautiful, beautiful sausage balls. Seems like I'm making a lot of balls on this channel. I, let's get back to it. Get your workout in for the day too. Use your hands, get up in there, this is fun. Cooking is fun, cooking is exciting. What else you can do is drink and have fun and cook, dude, this is awesome. Now it's time to roll them in them balls, dude. Get your little flour, get that on your hand. Now you can make your balls as big as you want or as small as you want. I like my balls about like that, you know? Put that like that. That's that parchment paper. All my life I used to say, hand me that paper that's not aluminum foil because it comes in the same dang thing. But I learned that's called parchment paper. Whatever that means. Another ball. And make you two or three dozen of those. Dude, you take that on some white bread, you smash that down with a little yellow mustard call on a cat head biscuit, a little homemade well, I call it homemade, but I call it that yard honey. Oh, you look at them balls, nice and pretty. Give me a little more flour on there, boom. Roll them up. These are fire. Your kids are gonna love these. Who don't like sausage and cheese rolled up into a ball, dude? Keep getting it, like that. Boom. Got your oven set, 350. Probably about 25, 30 minutes. But check them at about 15. Every oven's different, dude. It all depends on the altitude and stuff they tell me. Here we go, here we go. Oh yeah, make a good mess. Roll them up. You got your balls all laid out. 350, 20, 25 minutes until they golden brown. Put that in that oven, dude. Nice, pretty. And while we wait, we hydrate. Been about 20 minutes, they golden brown. Let us check them out. Your boy, look at here, look at here. It's like a sausage cheese biscuit all in one. Grab and go breakfast. You cook them, you put that in that ice box, heat that in that microwave for breakfast. Grab it, go get out of here. Look how pretty that is. Let's plate it. Let's see what they look like on the inside. Look at here, cheesy goodness hot the only thing left we got to do i like to drizzle it with that little yard honey y'all want to see some more b videos give me a little comment on that but know what i like to do take that sausage take your cracker assistant put that on a cracker dude mm. now you know that's money 